Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your6 Studios. Today in this video, I'm gonna show you how to fix your mouse not working on your PlayStation 5. So make sure you unplug it and then plug it back in and make sure there is a symbol that pops up on your screen that shows a little mouse. And then we know we have a proper connection. And then what we wanna do after we do that, we wanna go up to settings right here and then make sure we don't have any game updates or any kind of software updates on our PlayStation 5. So we can drop on down to system, go to system software updates and select this and go to update using internet. And sometimes you have a pending update in here and that might be causing an issue on some uh, components not working on your PlayStation. Also, we could just try verifying the licenses of the game. Uh, if you become unable to use some sort of content uh, you downloaded from the PlayStation store or something like that, uh, just selecting the game that you're having an issue with and then restoring the licenses can make this work. So just go ahead and try this out. And then in some specific games, you actually need to switch the input to mouse. So we'll do that too. Uh, so before we do that, let's go on down to uh, where it says accessories and there's some mouse settings we can change all around. So we have uh, settings right here. Let's go to mouse and tweak the settings for the pointer. So uh, let's go on down to other settings, go to the right. And then we have mouse right here. We have the right hand and then the pointer speed fast or slow. So now let's start up a game. So Call of Duty is one of the games where if you don't switch the mouse around from controller to the mouse input, you're simply not going to be able to use this. So no matter what settings you have on your PlayStation change, it's not going to make a darn bit of difference. So uh, let's go to uh, Black Ops or Warzone, whoever one and then launch into here. Now we have to do this before we start the game. Otherwise, it's going to lock in the controller input and we won't be able to switch it uh, when we're actually playing. So once we get in here, uh, press options and then we want to go to the controller settings and there should be a section specifically uh, just for mouse. So let's just retry to log in here and then press options and then go to controller. And then you can see the input. We can select mouse under here. So hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech up videos coming up next on your six studios.